Hey guys, welcome back to another video. As you can tell by the title of this video, we are going to be talking about Tory Burch items, you guys. Yes, Tory Burch. So if you are interested, stay tuned. All right, guys, so let's jump right into this video. I am bringing a shoe to you all today. I'm talking about a Tory Burch shoe. But before I jump into talking about this shoe, you know I got to give you a little bit of story time behind the item. So about two or three years ago, hubby gave me a birthday present. And one of the birthday presents was a Tory Burch purse. I fell in love with this bag. I told him that I thought the bag was super duper cute. Just telling him that I thought it was cute. And he went out and he got it as one of my birthday presents. So again, this was about two or three years ago. I wore the purse. I've had a great time wearing it. I love the bag. Um, I actually did a review on my channel on the bag. And at the time, I just didn't want to spend a lot of money on a pair of sandals to match this bag. So I just went, I can't even remember where I went to. I went and I bought a reasonably priced pair of sandals to match this bag. The bag that I am talking about it is the Tory Burch. Let me make sure I got the name right. Yes, it is the Tory Burch Kira Chevron Wallet on a Chain Bag. And I have it in a very beautiful shade of yellow. I don't believe that Tory Burch calls this color yellow. Um, but to just give you an idea, it is in the color of in the yellow family. So let me just get this bag out of the way so I can show you what I'm talking about. So here she is. Oh, yes. I love her, the Kira Chevron Wallet on a Chain Bag. She is in lambskin leather, super soft, and this is such a beautiful bag, and she is holding up well. Again, two to three years old, and I have carried her several times. No wear and tear on this beauty at all. Not one single spot. So just a quick, <clears throat> excuse me, y'all. Just a quick review of the bag right quick. She is twist turn. She has gold hardware. You open her up, and here's her chain. The um, chain is not adjustable. So in the front of the bag, you have a front pocket right here. Then you have a zip pocket right there. And then in the inside here, you have another huge pocket area. And then you have about six credit card slot pockets right here. So if you want to stick your cards in right there, you can. And then even behind those, we have another huge pocket. So this bad boy can carry a lot. For her to be little, she is little, but she can carry a lot. On the back of it, it also has a pocket right there where if you just want to stick something. Me personally, I wouldn't put anything right there, but you can put something right there. And then he also picked me up the card holder to match. This is such a beautiful card holder, guys, and I absolutely love it. Again, with the gold hardware, I'll make sure I give you all close-ups of this as well. And then you have two card slots on the front, two card slots on the back, and then it opens up, and then you can stick a card or two, probably about two to three cards in the inside right there. So this is the bag that we're working with. This is the bag that I was going all over the place trying to find a sandal to match this bag recently. If you have been keeping up on my vlogs, then you have seen that recently I was all on Shein, I was all um, on Fashion Nova, ordering sandals from there, trying my best to find a sandal that would match this bag. And I ordered, I can't remember, I think I may have ordered maybe like two or three sandals trying to find something to match this bag. I was unsuccessful, did not accomplish anything ordering those sandals from either one of those places because none of them end up matching this bag. Um, the shade was way off. I'm talking maybe like three or four shades off. Well, no, may, more than three, maybe like four to five shades off, maybe even six shades off was one pair of the sandals that I bought. But the sandals are so cute and they're reasonably priced. We're talking about Shein, Fashion Nova. So I kept those lovely sandals. And besides, I do love the color yellow. So I kept them. So I decided to finally stop and go in Tory Burch and just see what they had. Now, like again, again, I'm talking two to three years ago. I don't even expect Tory Burch to have anything in their store to match this bag. I honestly didn't. But... I took a chance, went into the store, and I found some samples. 
sandals, guys. Thank God I found something that is similar to it in color. Not exactly. I would say it's probably about two to three shades off, but it's not that bad. The shoe is going to be down here on my feet. The purse is going to be up here on my arm. So it's not that bad. Now, let me just go ahead and open this so I can show you what I picked up. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm back. So I love Toy Birch because the sandals do come with a lovely dust bag. And I ended up purchasing the Miller Square Toe Vig Nappa sandals. Again, this is the Miller Square Toe Vig Nappa sandal in a seven and a half. It's a thong style sandal if you know anything about the Miller slides. And anytime I wear a sandal with it in this style, a thong style sandal I tend to go up a half a size because I just want my foot to be a little bit more comfortable and especially with that piece that goes in between your toe I don't know about some of you all but if I have on flip-flops or a thong style sandal for too long and it's a little bit too small the piece in between my toe really irritates me and I just don't like that feeling so I said let me go up a half a size so I got a seven and a half and these lovely beauties are what I ended up picking up. Um, I know that these are not an exact match to my bag. Believe me, I know. I hope they're coming up true to color on camera for you guys. I know it's not an exact match, but I don't think it looks that bad, guys. I really don't think it looks that bad. So um, I hope you can see it again because it's not that bad. The only thing I thought about, my issue with this was Looking at, let me lay this one down, looking at the sandal, the sole is a different color than the leather part of the sandal. So I think the leather portion of the sandal, all of that matches the bag perfectly for me. It's just the sole of it, but my foot is going to be covering the majority of that up anyway, so who really cares? But um, yeah, guys, tell me down below what you all think. Comment down below. Tell me, do you think this is a good shoe to wear with this purse? You think I did okay? Or you think, no, sis, give it up. You shouldn't wear that slide <laughs> with this purse. So I tried, guys. I tried my best. And I really think for a bag that came from two to three seasons ago um, or years ago, I really think this is as, going to, as good as it's going to get. Unless I want to go on the... Um, pre-love sites like Macari, Fashion Nova, um, mm, Fashion Nova, Macari, um, what's the other one? Poshmark and see if I can find these. Now, before I went into the store, I did look to see if I could find a slide to match these and I did. I think I ended up finding one on Poshmark and Macari, but honestly, the price that they want for these Miller slides, even after they've been worn, some of these people are ridiculous. Y'all are ridiculous. Because some of these slides, I mean, the sole, the color of the sole is worn out. The leather is cracking. And the prices that they are asking for, for a used sandal that has that much wear and tear on it, it was just ridiculous. So I said, you know what? No, there's no way in the world I'm going to pay that much for a used sandal when I might as well just go into Tory Burch and buy a brand new slide and pay uh extra 40 or 50 dollars and have a brand new slide so that's what it is so again let me make sure i got this right y'all this is the miller square toe big napa miller slide big napa um the insole is hard hard this is the portion where the tour brush logo is that goes between your toe and the sides that is leather so that is very soft um i've told you guys in the past how i feel about tory birch um sandals or her slides would i wear them when i'm doing a lot of walking no ma'am no i've done it before and i paid the price and that's a whole nother story but um yeah if you're just gonna be out and about for a little while and you're not gonna be doing too much walking i'm saying maybe like hours of walking and stuff then you'll be fine in these these are comfortable to just have them on and be out and about but if you're going to be out and you know you're going to be doing a lot of walking like sightseeing or somewhere no, you don't want to wear the slides because your feet are going to be screaming. But yeah, guys, here they are again. I hope you can see them good in the light and everything is coming across correct. Comment down below. Let me know what you think. Be honest. 
yes, you think I did good, or no, you think um, the colors are off too much and I need to try again. All right, guys, I thank you so much for clicking on my video and taking the time to watch it. Thanks for rocking with your girl, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.